Yo, what's going on ladies and gents? My name is Arbuckle. Welcome back to another video. Today we are once again back on Modern Warfare and I wanted to share with you guys the best class setup for the new Grau 556 Shadow Sight Blueprint. Uh, this is a blueprint that's available in the Battle Pass and if you guys look at it, it's meant to be uh, played like an SMG. It almost looks like an AK-74U, but this is just a smaller version of the Grau that we're going to keep the same aspect of SMG feel to it, so it's going to still look like an SMG and feel like an SMG, but we're going to improve the stats overall so I really think you guys will like this now if you guys take a look at the stats that come with the original blueprint you'll see that because it's a very small weapon we obviously get a very very massive mobility boost we get a really nice accuracy boost as well have however we end up losing a ton of range and we lose a bit a little bit of control which obviously we can fix and make much better so if you guys take a look at the stats for the class setup that I'm gonna share with you in this video you'll see that we get a nice accuracy boost we get a really nice range boost a super good mobility boost again and instead of losing control we actually gain a ton of control which is nice so I really think you guys are gonna like this it feels like an SMG can play like an AR and uh, and just has really good stats overall and really good aim down sight speed uh, if you guys take a look at the attachments that we're gonna be using we're not using a muzzle the barrel that we're using is the FSS 26.4 Archangel so with this we're getting damage range bullet velocity recoil control this is one of the main attachments that's gonna focus on accuracy range of control you'll see that range and control boosts are massive uh, we lose a little bit of aim down sight speed here which we're going to make up for with a lot of the other attachments. The laser that we're using is the TAC laser, so we're running a laser because we are playing with this thing like an SMG. We are going to be able to play aggressive. We're going to get a nice boost in mobility and control as well as accuracy. Uh, the laser is important because we are playing this like an SMG, so that's going to be nice if we're running around corners, running through doorways. We'll be able to use the laser to kind of hit fire and, uh, and improve our chances of getting the kill. We're not going to be using an optic because it is an SMG lag. We are going to be rushing. We don't really need one with the Grau anyways. It's got a pretty decent iron sight. Uh, we don't want to lose more aim down sight speed anyways with that. Uh, the stock that we're using is no stock, so this is what we're keeping the same for the uh, keeping the same from the original blueprint. Obviously, this is going to give us a massive, massive mobility boost. We lose a lot of control, range, and accuracy here, which obviously we made up for with the first attachment, and we're going to make up for with some of the other ones. But no stock is what we're rocking, uh, so that we can keep it the same. We also get aimed on sight speed as a pro, which is really, really important. Uh, the underbell that we're using is the Cronin Shark 2. So with this, we're getting aiming stability as our only pro, but we get a boost to accuracy and range, but a massive boost to control, which is really, really nice. We were trying to get that control back up because obviously we didn't want it low, uh, so we're able to get that thing up and look really good. So we lose a very, very tiny bit of mobility here, which obviously isn't enough to make a, a, a difference whatsoever. So uh, again, you guys can see what the stats look like as of now. Uh, and last but not least, the rear grip that we're using is the XRK Void 2, which is essentially stippled grip tape for any other gun in the game. You'll see that we do get that last massive mobility boost. We lose a little bit of accuracy and control, which obviously is not a big deal. Uh, again, we get aim down sight speed as a pro, which is why we're really improving our aim down sight speed with this class setup. And we get sprint to fire speed, which is going to be important because we are playing with this like it's an SMG. We are going to be aggressive. We're going to be running through doorways around corners, and having sprint to fire speed is going to be really, really clutch. So... I'll give you guys one last look at all the attachments and the stats that come with this specific class setup. You guys can see they're all really good, really good aim down sight speed, uh, really good everything. I think you're really going to like this one. Uh, but if you guys have any questions about this specific class setup or the original blueprint, make sure to leave them down in the comment section below, and I'll be sure to try to help some of you guys out. I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. Please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I'll see how you guys in the next video. Can we be friends?